being fearless. So if you want to be successful with the bookkeeping business or any business for that matter, you cannot be going into it with fear because fear keeps you from doing certain things or it makes you do things in a way that you that aren't productive. So if you are f fearing failure, uh, which is the typical fear that people have when they start something, um, you have to combat that. So how do you how do you get over that? How do you get past the fear? And it's typically through preparedness and being prepared in when you start a bookkeeping business it consists of uh, doing certain things that uh, set your mind at ease one of them would be having your business set up completely having good branding having a professional logo professional website all those things make you feel better about yourself and they also make your business stand out uh, and then another thing you can do is also educate yourself, obviously. You need to be educated in the field of bookkeeping in order to run a successful bookkeeping business. However, some people think that they need to learn everything there is to know about bookkeeping before they start a bookkeeping business, and it's just not that way. You start with the basics. You learn basic knowledge of bookkeeping, basic knowledge of QuickBooks, and you use that on basic clients you want to have soft clients what I call soft clients or easy clients there are easy clients and hard clients and everything in between so picking the right clients to begin with is really important and you want your first client to be you do your household bookkeeping first that uh, by doing that you'll learn bookkeeping you'll learn QuickBooks you'll learn the software and um, there's no no problems, no potential problems there because it's your your books. Uh, the next step would be having doing the books for your friends or family. You might have a brother or sister or relative of some kind that um, has a business and needs bookkeeping, and they may allow you to do their bookkeeping. Then the next step, the third step, would be an actual bookkeeping client that you don't know. And you would want that client to be an easy client. And I go over what are easy clients in the platform and, and in my course. And so if you're looking for additional tips and lots of help in getting your bookkeeping business up and running, check out bookkeepinglife.com. And we're here to help you succeed. We've helped lots of people succeed since 2018. And we're continuing to do so. All right. I hope you have a great day. Don't let fear get in your way. Later.